Well, well, here we are again. Gypsy Lynn, do you know where we are? We're at the site of the first nuclear reactor. So, EBR-1, because here it is. As you can see, we're on the, we start the tour on the top floor. Wow, oh wow, here we go. Chain reactions. Okay, trying to be quiet, they're actually doing a real tour in there while I'm just doing one of these. There's a nuclear laboratory. Reactor shut down. I averted disaster. Pushing this button. Start up. I don't know what I'm doing here. I mean, I'm <laughs> this is what you do. Tips and then you better shut up. Hurry. What if it depended on you right now? Hit the hit the button. Shut it down. Hurry. My goodness, you would have to really know what you're doing. So here we have the control room for the reactor. This is where everything was operated and monitored. At all times, there were two operators and one supervisor in this room. Atomic power. Atomic power is cleaner. Look at these breeding blankets here. The uranium that it needs. First electric from nuclear power. What are you supposed to do with this? Look at this generator. That's what we need at the house. That generator. Look! Look how bright these lights are. See how great. Right. Evacuation route. Here we go. Something's happening. Something's happening. We gotta get out. This is the proper way to go. Look at this. radiation suit before you go in here. That's the knack area. Use no water. We really don't know what this is, but it looks like it's something that would show how it's built. 
water softener salt. Right here is one of the four original light bulbs. 1951, first nuclear power. Let's see what's inside here. Here is more science learning. What is radiation? Zero power reactors. Gypsy Lynn is turning. Radiation emitted by the radioactive disc from EBR1 displayed here can be measured by turning the crank to bring the radiation detector closer <laughs> while observing the meter and the clicking sounds. Each click indicates a separate radiation emission. Do you hear it? Yeah, I hear it now. It's hard to hear. It's hard to turn, I told you. It's not easy to turn. What's this? Vault. little fun pick action you could have right there. Caution, special instructions. Contact radiological control before working in this area. This board here. Oh my. Please do not touch. Master Slave Manipulator. These things are probably highly radioactive in there. That's why they're in this giant vault. Safe space to handle radioactive materials. Idaho Snake River. The Plain Aquifer. Luckily for us, these radioactive materials is <laughs> they used to play dice like this. You gotta be kidding me. This is out of order. I was really wanting to test this. Careful, they break easily. of EBR2. What if we could harness atomic energy? Let's see what's going on here. Oh, I'm at control here. 
let's turn this safety knob to non. We've got definitely. Ah, oh, reset that. All right. This gauge right here is representing the primary pump number one speed. Right now it's at zero. Everything looks to be normal. <sighs> Let's just make sure. Watch everything over here. Make sure everything's all right. We've done our duty. We have prevented everything from happening. We didn't even start anything from happening. So that is a great day. Look at this. Does the world know the EBR secret? They absolutely do. This right here is the fallout shoulder. Do not go beyond this point. On the ladder. <laughs> what is this? Let me think. See through the window, controlled. What is this? A reflector made of uranium 200, 238 bricks around the reactor core when penetrated by neutrons of uranium were converted to plutonium, the new fuel pred EBR1 using the machinery in the cell and operator looking through this window could remove and replace the bricks one by one. Hmm. Wow, oh wow. Right here outside, they have heat experimental reactors. Let's look at around a little bit at this other one. These are so huge they gotta put them outside because they're experimental. And that looks like it was what they used to haul uranium on a train or something, maybe. I don't know. Somebody knows, just tell me. And look at this landscape. All here in Arco. Idaho. Amazing, isn't it? Beautiful. 